Hello everybody, my name is Aceway, welcome back to Let's Play Kaiser Reich in Heart of Iron 4. Let's continue on from where we last left off. So, luckily the game, or well the game updated to version 0.2. Luckily that it didn't actually corrupt the save file, so that's good. One of the disappointments of the update though, is that now it kind of forces the Kaiser Reich music in the background. So that kind of sucks that some of it is copyrighted, so hopefully that doesn't cause too many issues. No, but let us continue on. We have low manpower. Yeah, I kind of figured that. I didn't think that would have changed. Over here in Flanders, things are kind of going, I would say, bad. Uh, we basically need... Like, do we leave? Because if we lose this naval base, then we're screwed. Because we can't act to escape and we also won't get resources. So, knowing that, these ten guys here, I'm going to basically just assign... I'm going to basically have them go here. You know what? Actually, I'm going to gate. I'm going to take my entire army. Uh, you guys are just going to relocate to Southern Ireland. Can they sustain that? Uh, I'm not. I'm not too sure. But it doesn't really matter. All of you guys, basically, all the blue army. You're just going to leave Flanders. Okay, profits are no longer available. I mean, that kind of makes sense because the, uh, the cities did just get annexed by China, so... So basically, is it the same thing no matter what happens? There's nothing we can do. Yeah, okay. Well, there's nothing we can do. Also, I think I said there's, there's no thing we can do. So, I mean, that's good. Okay, now everybody here just retreat. We have one. You guys just can we not retreat into Brussels? Yeah, I mean I don't really care about Flanders too much. I I think it's fine just leaving it. But we need to protect the port. There's really no question about that. So once everybody's gathered. Okay, so wait. No, these are events that I think we're supposed to fire. We started our beer incident in the shell force. Uh, the British Socialist Navy is now devoted our right claims. Uh, Royal Canada. Okay, wait, no, I think these are up to, are, uh, events added into version point two. But because they've already happened, all the events are now just going to start firing like one after another. So, I mean, there might be a lot of pop ups. I'm not too sure. We shall see, but I think that was about when we did those naval exercises, like, 10 episodes ago. Actually, I think we're only, like, episode 9 or something, so, you know, like, 5 episodes ago or whatever. Oh, so there's, there's 30 guys. Where are those other 30? I don't know. Well, you guys are already, you guys are all here. I mean, we can basically hold this port indefinitely, but... I think we should probably go to... Is Dublin really the only naval base? I guess there's one up there. Is there no other ones? I guess not. I thought there might have been one on the southern island. But I guess you guys just kind of all go... I can't even find the button there to click. So I guess you go up to here. Can we not go... No, you 26 guys. I want you to just basically go... Can we not retreat? Maybe we just can't retreat. I'm not too sure why. 98, 99. Oh, we know convoys. Right. Um. I guess what we can do, right, just, just for a second, is just cancel all imports. Trade and supply. Yeah, I know we're not... We don't, I know we don't have enough stuff, but I need the... Uh, I need the convoys. But I don't know if we're actually going to be able to get those convoys. So, that could be an issue. Is this naval invasion ready to go yet? I think you're holding up a lot of... How many convoys are you holding up? Only 20. Okay, but not as much as I thought. I think a lot of those are actually coming from importing weapons. So, who are we actually importing weapons from? Is there a way I can actually easily see that? 
Military access. Yeah, uh, you. I don't even know what we're. I don't even know what we're getting. We're getting ten rifles from you. Yeah, I, I was importing too many weapons. A lot of those were actually kind of useless. Yeah, so how about we just kind of. Yeah, they're sending us 20 rifles a month. And that's costing us a ton of transports for really no reason. So what are you what are you sending us? You are sending us. They're also just sending us 10 rifles. Yeah, like they're sending unless these are percentage points. Like what are you sending us? 20, I mean, no current land lease. At least now we have convoys. Uh, and then we're getting stuff from Austria. Yeah, that might be a percentage. Which is weird. We don't have enough convoys to get this stuff. From the United States, I think it's fine because we, we have a land border. But everywhere else, it's kind of an issue. But hopefully now we can have enough convoys to actually send these guys to Ireland. Well, we can send eight of them. I guess that's better than nothing, but... Okay, so you're going there. Where are those other guys? I think we're sending, uh... Like, where are you? Okay, you're in Quebec City. You haven't really done anything yet. Okay, well, that's fine. Once we get enough convoys, we can uh, kind of fix that issue. Transferring troops. Yeah, we're using 46 here. Oh, so it's negative 46 and negative 46 needed. Fine, fantastic. But do we use convoys to send other people stuff? I don't think so. And I think you guys should be ready to do your invasion of Cardiff. So hopefully this actually works out. All right. Actually, can we, uh, where is... Exercise. I want to get these guys to at least be regular. Before they attack Cardiff. Because having too many rookies, I can understand would be kind of a bad thing. And we basically have complete control over the the, the, uh, the Navy, or the, uh, the waters around Britain, so we probably shouldn't have to worry about our actual ships being sunk. I mean, hopefully. Yeah, so they're at, what, like, 99%. These are at 75. Daily like combat experience to next level. One. Okay, so it'll take about a few more days. But I think that's fine for the most part. I don't think we need to worry about that too much. Italy. You want to join the Entente now? Like, you should. You're part of the war. And we're the, we're the side that's actually winning the most. So... I'm just saying, you should join us. Yeah, it sucks that they landed this one, because I, I guess we got it right that time. Trade and supply. I don't understand. Like, okay, I'm going to cancel all imports. Yeah, cancel that. Like, in trade, we're not importing anything at all. Just actually give me some of everything. Yeah, thank you. Just more convoys and stuff. That's nice. Okay, well, they're just sending troops automatically. That's actually probably why we were still stuck at zero. So, are you guys ready to go soon? 84%. You're at 93. You know what? It's, it's good enough. Launch an invasion of Cardiff. I can't imagine... Okay, well, actually, can I look at marine stats? They have a bonus attack, marsh, river, amphibious. They have a 50% attack bonus. We got some, we got some uh, Indian rifles here as well. I don't know how good the Indian rifles are, but... I think I guess I never really looked at that. Like, are you guys... Like, you got some Emma Grayrins, you got some Austrian rifles. Like, pick a assortment of different rifles here. We're currently winning. These guys have, like, no morale at all. It's going really poorly. 
at night, terrain, naval penalty. Yeah, I kind of thought that would have gone a little bit better. These guys just have no organization. They lost it all. Really, Spain? You join... Ger look, you join Germany? Look at, look at Germany at the moment, Spain. You disappoint me so much. Also, you have like 40 brigades. You're, you're so screwed, Spain. So I'm assuming we're probably not going to win that one. Okay, fine. Go back home. How bad was that battle for us? 1,000... It could have been a lot worse, honestly. But we just had no organization, which is probably my fault. Because they were training, and I believe that sucks up all their organization. So, yeah. Probably could have done that one a little bit better. Do we have to wait again, or do we just do it right away? Oh, nice. We can just do it straight away. As soon as these guys get their organization. Uh, this is probably just about planes, right? Yeah, I know we don't have planes, okay? Actually, now we can actually just start importing stuff we need again. Uh, trade. Steel? We need, we need steel. United States, give me your steel. You surplus of this. Surplus, 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 surplus. Wait, we're fine on everything, which is surprising to me. We only have 28 military factories. That's really, really bad. It's because we're building these oil refineries. Also, why are we spending so much consumer goods? 32 foot. That's a lot higher than it used to be. I think we need to go on the, like, war economy as soon as we have the points, but we're not getting points very fast. At least these actually are updated, so they actually uh, are named properly. But I don't believe, uh, like, some more countries got event trees, but I don't think those affect these ones, which is, at least that's nice. At least it doesn't, you know, screw up our game, because I think in National Folks, it's change. The game basically crashes every single time we try to launch it. But we actually, we do have troops here. I don't know why we're engaging. Uh, but your offensive line basically, yeah, is just take here. I hate that the line does- it does it every single time. But your job is to go here and then down. Uh, you're only gonna do that, like, careful. Don't... push too far if you don't think you can do it. Actually, one of you guys can come over here and try to take this city. If you can try to do that, that'd be nice. Oh, Ned, Rave, uh, okay. Well, that's 60 shift against one. I'm pretty sure we'll be fine there. Okay, these guys are getting up their strength again. Is Bristol weaker than Cardiff? Is there a way you can tell? Uh, not really. I don't see, I don't see, like, a clear indicator. Actually, there's a naval base down here. How did I not, how did I not notice this one? Was it always there? Edit mode. Edit this. Yeah, do that one. That looks a lot easier because it's just in the uh, that planes. It might be a marsh, but I think that's still easier to take on than a city. So if you can land a corner wall, that'd be fine. But oh, the Germans actually pushed their way into uh, France again. That's nice. Yeah, that city's not going to go... There's just too many French troops there. And how are, ba how are battles here? We're only losing 21% of the battles. So that's good. I I'm kidding. That's actually terrible. But th these numbers are way in our favor. I wish there was a... Like, there's manpower loss, but I wish there was... How many people we've killed. Because there's no real easy way to see that number, sadly. Yeah, let's get an aggression back with Spain. I still can't believe they joined Germany. It's a, it's an insult. They, it's it's an insult to us that they would even consider that. Yeah, so they have one infantry. He's defending territory. That's not really surprising. But you're not at full strength. If anything, you know what? Re or reinforcements are probably like the most important thing. So you guys just do that. You don't have a lot of manpower right now, though. Let's go for a second invasion. 
land now in Cornwall. Also, are you guys, like, under... Supplied? Yeah, okay. So you guys should also, like, garrison a little bit of, like, Northern Ireland. You know, to split that number up nicely so you can actually have the supplies. And is everybody here? Like, these, these tanks aren't deployed properly. What do we need to have a route there? It's it's across the it's just across Ireland. Go walk over there. It's not too difficult. So I uh, Italy looking is looking fine. We got eighty percent chance here. Naval penalty minus twenty percent. But your but your Marines. That's like your job is to do that. Another 25 days, 21 days. They just have a lot of defense. Stacking penalty? What's it mean, rewarding to? It's 10 people. Can I see, like, what's, what is the stacking penalty? I don't remember. Like, what's the penalty for that? So my, it's only a minus four percent, but still. Can I edit this like right now? Uh, edit, edit, edit. Can I do that? Yeah, no, that's not looking like it's going to work either. I mean, they're losing organization faster than we're losing organization. So if we just kind of keep pushing, we can maybe win. 11, 12. Like our guys, 46 or 44. They have a, they have a lot of max organization. But they're, they, yeah, they do have lower than us. Can I see how the battle's going, like, through here? No, I think it only shows up as soon as the battle's over, sadly. So yeah, you guys just keep kind of pushing up there. You know, Italy... How many troops does Italy have? They have probably, like, a, like, probably have like 120 brigades. And that's nice, because they're kind of pushing us on one front. Compared to France, who's pushing here, here, and here. And also probably has troops over in, other, in actual Germany as well. I'm surprised that Germany even exists in any capacity like look at this they're in one two three four five separate pieces i mean up here there's probably like uh lithuanians and ukrainians and stuff but still okay so let's reinforce the italians yeah they're marching down here which is nice Sadly, they're still not part of our faction. I don't know how I would get them into our faction. I mean, they love us, too. We're improving relations with them. Or we were. Invite the faction. Start a lend lease. Is there anything we have that we don't actually need? We have a lot of actually... We have a lot of rifles. Do you want... Rifles? Twenty-one. Well, we'll send like two hundred and fifty a month. And does that take our, our things or their things? Their convoys. I'm not. I'm not too sure actually. We will get there first, actually. Uh, one day. They'll get there in sixteen hours. So if like if we get there first, then it goes to France. But if Italy gets there first, then it just goes to them, which is disappointing. So let's try to at least take some territory. Just so it'll go to France actual. Yeah, we're actually doing pretty uh, nicely over here. Ah, uh, we actually have landed our troops. Which actually means uh, you guys now absolutely need the front line like here immediately. But that's going to be important. But I do think this is going to be a good time to end this video. So thanks so much for watching. My name is Anthem. If you enjoyed, remember to thumbs up. Now enjoy, click thumbs down. Want to see more, subscribe, and goodbye.